Hello my friend, Caleb Bright here from Bitcoin Lifestyles Club. And today, I'm gonna to show you how to buy and sell cryptocurrency from the order books instantly at current market prices on the Bittrex cryptocurrency exchange. Right now, I'm on the exchange page for Stellar XLM, trading against Bitcoin. We're just gonna scroll down a little bit underneath this candlestick chart here so we can use the buying and selling forms that are located in the middle of the page here between the buying side of the order book on the left in green here and the selling side of the order book on the right in red. To trade Bitcoin against XLM and that would get you XLM in your XLM wallet you will use the buying form which is open by default you see with buy highlighted in green when you open a coin exchange page like this. And if you want to trade XLM against Bitcoin, that means you'll have XLM in your XLM wallet and you're trading it back for Bitcoin. You will use the selling form by just clicking the little gray sell button here. It'll highlight and turn red and enable you to use this form to trade XLM back against Bitcoin. We'll just click back to the buy side of the form. Notice at the bottom of the buying and selling form area, there is some text here that says available balance. This shows your available balance of BTC for trading on Bittrex. Right now, it indicates that I have an available balance of 0 0.05 BTC. And you can also take notice that it will show your available balance of whatever altcoins market exchange page you are on. In this case, you can see I have over a few hundred thousand XLM in my Bittrex exchange account wallet. So we will start with the buying form since I have some Bitcoin available. To view what prices that XLM is currently trading at, we will use the buy side of the order book here on the left where you can see the numbers in green. The green numbers represent the Satoshi price level of the bid orders that are lined up to buy XLM. You can see that the column heading is labeled with the word bid. The red section of the prices over here on the right side of the screen are displaying all the sell orders of XLM that are currently lined up for sale at the moment. You can see that the name of the column heading is ask because that's the price that the sellers are asking to sell their XLM for. Then the next column over from the bid and the ask prices on each side is the size. The size column will show the exact number of XLM tokens that are available for sale at that given Satoshi price level. So for example, at the price of 2,945 Satoshis, there's 337 XLM that are trying to be purchased. And conversely, on the selling side, at 2,960 Satoshis, there's 108 XLM that are trying to be sold at that price level. The next column over on each side that's labeled total will display the total BTC value of the orders that are stacked up at that Satoshi price. So for example, there's 0.1832 Bitcoins worth of sell orders at the price of 2,944 Satoshis here. And the sum column will add up the amount of BTC value as you add each Satoshi price level down the column. This will give you an idea of how much Bitcoins value worth of XLM that it would take to drop the coin down to a certain Satoshi price. It would take six Bitcoins worth of XLM selling into the bid orders to lower the price to 2,931 Satoshis. As you see right here, 6.43 Bitcoins is what it would take to fill all of these orders down to this row right here at the 2,931 Satoshi price level. And it works exactly the same for each of these columns over on the sell side order book, just in regard to the selling dynamic. And if you still need help learning how to read Satoshi values, which is really important to your success when maximizing your profits and trading altcoins against Bitcoin, make sure to review my training within the Fundamentals of Crypto Trading section of the Bitcoin Lifestyles Club course. And you can toggle the view of these order books so you can see deeper into either of them. All you have to do is click the next button at the bottom of the order forms in order to move to a page deeper in the order book. Or you can use the numerical navigation at the bottom to dig deeper faster into the pages of the order book. And we can click the first button to go back to the very first page 
or the last button to go to the very last pitch. So now we are going to use the buying form to buy some Stellar XLM at the current market prices. So let's take a scan of the selling order book, the one in red over here. It looks like with 0.05 Bitcoin, I can currently buy from these very first sell orders over here on the sell side order book at about 2,969 Satoshis since there is more than 0.05 Bitcoins worth of XLM for sale at these Satoshi price levels. So we can just click the Satoshi price here at the top of the sell side order book. So to go through with purchasing at the current market price of XLM, we can just click the Satoshi price here in the sell order book. That will populate the buying form with that Satoshi price here on the left. Then we can just click the max buy button here down at the bottom of the form and that will automatically fill the total BTC that we're trying to spend with the total amount that I have which is 0.05 BTC and then we will click the buy lumens button. It will show us some order information that we can confirm, like the Satoshi price and how much BTC that we're spending, how much XLM that that gets you. And we'll click confirm in order to proceed with purchasing the XLM. As you can see here, the buy has been completed for the XLM. I just picked up 1,681 XLM for my 0.05 Bitcoin at the price of 2,966 Satoshis. And so that will have made my balance go from around 327,000 XLM to now 328,950 XLM here under my available balance underneath the buying form. So now that we picked up some XLM, now it's time for me to show you the other part of the process, how to trade it back for Bitcoin. Now ideally, we would wait until the price becomes higher so we can sell it at a profit. But of course, this video is being done for example purposes just to show you how to do this. So I will go ahead and sell these coins at virtually break even minus whatever Satoshis in the trading fee, which will probably be a fraction of a cent anyways, so no big deal. So it's very similar to buy an XLM, except we're gonna click the sell side order form by clicking the sell button here. Now it's highlighted in red, and we're ready for the next step. Now we could observe the buy side order book, and these are the orders that are lined up that can purchase the XLM that we're trying to sell. We have 1,680 XLM to sell, so it looks like we could sell it at the price of 2,943 Satoshis. So we'll left click the Satoshi price and it will populate that Satoshi price in the ask price field of the selling form in the middle here. Then under quantity for XLM, we're just gonna type 1680 because that's the amount that we had just purchased. And then we will click sell lumen and it will get us 0.04931879. So it's very, very small little loss here just to show you this example of how to do this. It'll bring up the order details for the sell. Go ahead and click confirm. And we've processed the sell and it's complete. And that will have affected the orders up here and depleted them and made them smaller. In fact, there's only orders at 2942 now. I wiped out the orders that were available for buying at 2943 with my very, very small sell. And if you want to be even faster about setting up your sells or your buys, and not even mess with this form in the middle here, you can use the blue sell button next to any of these Satoshi prices on the buy side or the blue buy button next to any of these Satoshi prices on the sell side. And basically, it'll just set the order up for you to purchase. Say, if you were to hit buy right here, it would set you up to buy all of the XLM from all these orders from this order and up. See, when I click the buy button, it then shows the order information in this pop-up window right here. Then if I click the sell button over here on the buy side of the order book, similar thing. If we had the amount of XLM required to, we would sell down to all these orders. We would sell the same amount of XLM that is in all of these rows added together. If we clicked sell right here and clicked confirm, and that would be about 52,000 XLM. So that's how you can be even faster than even filling these forms customized to your needs. You can just use it like a blunt object 
and instantly sell the market and instantly buy the market prices that are currently available. I hope you enjoyed this video training showing you how to buy or sell the cryptocurrency market instantly from the order books of the Bittrex exchange. If you found this video training to be helpful, I would really appreciate your support. All you have to do is click the like button and leave a comment below with your feedback or any questions you have. You can also share it with your friends on social media who might also be interested in getting started with the Bittrex cryptocurrency exchange. If you are still really new to cryptocurrency, be sure to check out my free crypto mini course and gain a foundational understanding of Bitcoin, blockchain, and cryptocurrency, how it's changing the world, and how you can benefit and profit from it. Just submit your best email at www.freecryptominicourse.com to get it for free right away and with no strings attached. I will also put a link to this in the video description below. If you are ready to dive headfirst into the world of cryptocurrency trading, investing, and mining and get the best results possible, you should take a serious look at my cryptocurrency trading, investing, and mining mastery course and my 24-7 running mastermind chat group on Slack. You can get more info about all of this at my website www.bitcoinlifestyles.club and if you'd like more information, you can find a link in the video description below. Feel free to contact me if you have any questions. Stay tuned for the next training video in this Bittrex exchange guide, where I'm going to be showing you how to place bid and sell orders deeper in the order books at specific prices so you can anticipate and have your orders in position for beneficial price movements of the market, allowing you to more effectively buy low and sell high and maximize your profits. Caleb Wright here from Bitcoin Lifestyles Club, and I wish you nothing but success with the crypto markets. Stay prosperous, and I'll catch you on the next training video.